you guys are in a rush like me, if you guys are in a rush to get to school, get to class, get to work, you know, you got to get up in the morning, but you don't want to, you know, you don't want to cook. You don't want to spend 30, 45 minutes cooking, cracking eggs, you know, doing oatmeal and stuff. This is a perfect way to get in your calories. This is my on-the-go protein shake. I've made a video about this about a year ago, and it was kind of a boring video, so I decided to go ahead and do a little uh, re-upped version right now just to show you guys. And um, it's very calorie dense, very tasty. Let me show you guys the ingredients right now. You will need uh, one scoop of protein, any kind of protein, any brand, any flavor will do. One banana, frozen is uh, best, but since I don't have any frozen, you know, regular banana will do. We have some peanut butter, but if you guys have almond butter, you guys can use that as well. We have some just plain quick cooking oats that are in here, you can't see. About, um, I, use a, I use a full cup of oats. And then we have some honey. Go ahead, take your peanut butter. Um, you can take it, do about two tablespoons, which is about uh, 16 grams of fat, seven protein, eight carb. So let's just, we're not gonna follow that. We're just gonna take a big old scoop since we're bulking. Add in the honey. And by the way, guys, I just have a Vitamix blend there. Got about five to six ice cubes in there with some water. Honey. Time for the banana. Full cup of oats. Let's go ahead and put in a scoop of protein. Um, this, this flavor is a s'mores flavor. It tastes pretty good, but I suggest like plain flavors like vanilla or chocolate for these kind of protein shakes. That's what it looks like. All you gotta do is blend it up. So I'm headed into work right now and um, your protein shake, oh my god, I'm trying to drive, hold the damn camera and film. But um, if you guys made the protein shake right, it should fit in your blender bottle uh, pretty perfectly. So you guys can just take this on the go wherever you gotta go, school, work, class, you name it. But I myself am actually on the way to work, which is why I made uh, that short little clip. And uh, so that's why I'm, <laughs> I'm dressed up right now. Um, it is uh, Monday, how much is it Friday? It's Monday, January 12th, and uh, heading into work, but only for a few hours. I'm gonna be training some back today, I think, a little bit later, so I might be going during prime time. That's gonna suck, because everyone wants to go to the gym on Monday. It's like when it comes like four or five o'clock on Monday, man, that is prime time. But about to head into work, only for a little bit though, so I'll catch up with you guys very soon. All right, guys, we just got home from work not too long ago. It is currently 3 o'clock, 3.04 actually, just to be precise. And uh, I went ahead and made a little pre-workout snack. I'm not sure when I'm going to be training. Um, hopefully, hopefully before 5, because 5 o'clock is when it starts to get really crowded on Mondays. But um, either way, I'm going to show you guys my pre-workout snack. We have three whole eggs and then two egg whites. And then we just got an everything bagel with some cream cheese spread on top and then also I'm going to be having my Optiman multivitamin and my joint pill. Man, when I take this joint pill, I don't know if it's just mental or something, but my knees and everything feel way better when I take a joint pill. So if you guys are having knee problems, elbow problems, um, try investing in a decent joint pill like glucosamine or something. I mean, this one here is just like a cheap one from Walmart and it was like 15 bucks and I feel like I've got to take this supplement. So yeah, um, not sure what I'm gonna do, but I'm, I'm training back today. So maybe might get a little bit of footage for you guys. It's gonna be packed, I know, because it's Monday. So I'm gonna try my best, and I'll catch up with you guys later. All right, so that was an absolute fail. Um, the time is currently 8, 17 p.m. And uh, <laughs> I had to improvise today. I had to take in my car, I've been having car problems, and I had to take it into the shop so they can give me a rental. And I'm actually in a rental car right now. You guys probably can't tell, but I'm in a rental car. And uh, I didn't get to the gym till about 6.45, 7 o'clock. It's 8.20 right now. And it was just action-packed in there. It was just, it was ridiculous. I was roaming the LA Fitness parking lot for like 10 minutes. And I was like, you know what? Screw this. We parked across the street at Walgreens, which is where I'm at right now. I mean, it was... I just felt lost in the gym because everything was taken. There were so many people. 
New Year's resolution. People are, you know, everyone's at the gym on Monday, and it was just action packed. I couldn't get any footage for you guys because, I mean, there was just some. I was there was people everywhere. So uh, yeah, I don't know. I think I'm about to go grab some Chipotle. I'm gonna cut it off for today, and I'll catch up with you guys another day. Eight forty one AM on this Wednesday morning. I'm about to go get a workout in. I usually I never train this early. And the reason why I'm training this early is because I got work at ten thirty. I got work at ten thirty all the way to ten thirty, so that's twelve hours. You know, a lot of people that, that try to go to the gym and you know, they say they can't they, they use the word can't or they use the sentence I don't have enough time. It doesn't make sense to me. It doesn't make sense. Oh, I don't have enough time to go to the gym. I, I work so many hours. I'm just so tired. And the bottom line is, guys, if you want it bad enough, you'll find a way. And if you don't want it bad enough, you'll find an excuse. So, um, we're going to get a quick workout in. We're going to hit some chest. Um, hopefully for about an hour and a half until I go into work at 1030, 1045. So uh, just remember that next time, guys. If you guys are debating whether or not to go to the gym, like how bad do you guys want it? Do you want it bad enough that you're willing to sacrifice, or do you just want to just go go by with a day and be like, oh, I'll just go the next day, or oh, I'll go tomorrow? You know, just don't live like that. Make it happen today, and uh, you won't regret it. <laughs> Alright, what's going on guys? Just finished up training some legs. And uh time is currently eight o'clock, January 15th. This video is just gonna be like a compilation of just like so many days, like three or four days maybe. Because I don't have really have a lot going on. But uh just finished training some legs at a restaurant called Longhorns. Um it's like a Texas roadhouse kinda kinda deal. And um we went ahead, ate some salad. Finished up on the bread and we got my meal right here, which is 
Parmesan crusted chicken, so two patties, and then just a side of fries. Uh, pretty standard meal, lots of protein, kind of a lot of fat, but you know, I'm on that Boca piece. So uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, go ahead, hit that like button. Much appreciated. Hit that subscribe button if uh, you're new to the channel, and I'll see you guys later.